Washington, November 8 Brancilatina The government of the United States today announced more restrictions to U.S. citizens interested in doing business with Cuba and traveling to the Caribbean island, by virtue of a presidential memorandum that reverses major aspects of the two countries' rapprochement. The Departments of State Treasury and Commerce announced the adoption of coordinated actions to implement the documents signed by President Donald Trump on June 16 in Miami, Florida, which includes banning U.S. business people from doing transactions with more than 180 Cuban companies. It also establishes that all people to people non academic educational trips must be sponsored by an organization under U.S. jurisdiction. According to a communique from the Office for Foreign Assets Control OFAC, the Departments of Treasury and the Industry and Security Office of the Department of Trade announced amendments to the Cuban Assets Control Rule and the Exports Administration Regulations. Such measures entail changes in the program of sanctions against Cuba that was announced by the Republican president in June, when he decided to roll back several steps on Cuba taken his predecessor, Barack Obama 2009-2017. The changes which include complementary measures by the Department of State, will come into force tomorrow, when they will be published in the Federal Register.